Did you know that each time you flick on a light switch, you're actually completing a circuit? Electricity flows through a closed path, allowing energy to travel from the power source to the bulb, lighting up your room in seconds. An electric circuit is a closed path that lets electric current move from one place to another. The current travels from a power source, through wires and components, and then returns back to the source, just like a racetrack for electricity. Every working circuit starts with a power source, like a cell or battery. It gives the push, or voltage, that moves the electric charges through the wires and into the components. In a circuit, components are the parts that use electrical energy to do useful work. A bulb changes it into light, a buzzer turns it into sound, and an electric motor changes it into movement. Each component plays a special role in using the energy from the circuit. Conducting wires are like the roads for electricity. They link the battery, switch, and components, carrying the current safely from one part of the circuit to another. The switch is like a gate that controls the flow of electricity. When it's open, the path is broken and no current can flow. When it's closed, the path is complete and electricity moves freely, allowing the bulb to work. To make circuits easy to read and draw, scientists and engineers use symbols to represent each component. A cell is shown by two lines, a bulb by a circle with a cross, a switch by a break in a line, and so on. These simple symbols make it easier to plan and understand circuits. When all the parts, the power source, wires, switch, and components, are connected correctly, electricity can flow in a full loop. This complete circuit carries electrical energy from the battery to the component, where it's changed into light, sound, or motion. Let's recap. Circuits carry electrical energy, components use that energy to do work, and symbols help us draw and understand how everything connects together. Remember, electricity only works when the circuit is complete. Thanks for watching, and keep exploring with Mr. G Explains.